All right, here is Desktop Goose and uh, here is DNSpy. If you don't know how to get DNSpy, then uh, watch the video I linked in the description. I'm not going to repeat how to download it. I already made a tutorial how to download it in the past. Once you have DNSpy, uh, let's assume there's some stuff in here. Just uh, click somewhere here, press Ctrl A or I don't know, edit, select all probably. I don't know. Just press something here, hit Control A, and then delete, or maybe right click, delete. Yeah, this works. So this is empty. Okay, the next step, uh, you could drag in goose desktop.exe, but this leads to problems sometimes. It's better if you drag in the whole folder. Okay, now go into goose desktop, go into the purple thing, and here you have well, blocks, I don't know, these are not classes, are they? Let's see, if you hover over stuff, you, you find out what they are called, usually. Okay, this doesn't say what it is, but this here is a class. Um, and then in a class, so the turquoise stuff, are that's a class. Uh, these should be functions or methods. And in here, for example, you have the class of the goose. So somewhere in here, you can find the speed of movement, uh, how fast it moves and stuff like AI behavior. For example, when it decides that now I need to go and um, get a window. Yeah, there's speed here. You could try screwing around with these. Let me just show that off. This is one of, this is one of the most interesting things to change. Let me just start Goose desktop. So let you see how sl slow it is, right? Uh, let's change, uh, whoops. So to change this, to change this, I right clicked in here and pressed edit method. Okay, and now I will just change the walk speed. So let me set this to 800 instead of 80. Um, yeah, let's do that. So I pressed, sorry, I'm being too fast. I pressed compile and then, important, you have to go to file, save module and press OK. And then you have to start this because if you make changes while it's running, first of all, you will have problems saving, second of all, it will not work, you have to restart. Okay, did you see that? It was much faster. And it's much faster again. <laughs> oh, I love this. By the way, I'm pressing Alt F4 to get out of the goose. If I don't click anything after clicking the goose, then I can quit the goose that way by pressing Alt F4. Okay, uh, let's switch uh, speeds for everything here. Let's just increase everything tenfold. Because I want, to, I want you to see how... Um, Oh, and now we have problems. Now it's starting to have problems. Edit method. That's weird. Huh. Okay, let's try to solve this by just removing everything. I, again, uh, clicked somewhere, pressed Control A and deleted everything. Let's drag in everything. Um, goose desktop, the goose, and set speed, wasn't it? I wonder, maybe I have to update the end spy. Okay, this time it works, so let's go to save module. That's interesting because I've had troubles with that before. Come on, goose. Move, move, move. Now I'm gonna try to... Now I'm gonna try to click it. Okay, it has my cursor. And now the problems begin. You see, it's so fast, it's unable to get to its destination properly. <laughs> Oh boy. So if you change things, you can screw things up easily. Unfortunately, I don't know how to handle this. I don't know how to fix this horrible thing. Oh boy. Uh, how do I get out of this? Oh yeah, hold down escape for 10 seconds or so. Yep, that is the life. Okay, I'm gonna set this all back. 80... 200, 400, please work. Phew, I don't know why it worked this time. Okay, one thing every modder should do before I change, show you another thing. The first thing you should do is to make sure that the position of the, um, of the goose when it starts is not outside of the screen somewhere, but on the screen so you can debug it easier, so you can see much easier, uh, sorry, much faster uh, if it 
if it uh, appears if it's just broken anyways the goose when you click the goose immediately you see in it and here is the line you should change right click edit method let's change this to 200 or 120 it was minus 20 before let's save a module oops let's just save module press ok and it starts on the screen alt f 4 ing that okay and now one thing i wanted to show you because somebody was requesting how to make the goose not get any screens main game uh that was the goose it was here run ai this is the easiest thing to well remove stuff let's see so we have run wanderer uh, run nab mouse run track mud run collect window what all right so what we want to change here uh, I don't know why there is a break here. I'm a bit confused about this stuff. Anyway, so let's edit this. Um, now let's assume we want the goose to only wander and do nothing else. Then let's just replace everything with run, run wander. And we're gonna keep this for the case of donate. I don't understand what does it mean if they are next to each other does it mean they they are all like this result in the same i don't get it anyways i'm going to move donate up here because we are we were asked to, as modders to preserve that feature uh and this i guess that's it i guess that's it so let's ah come on control cannot fall through from one case label to another oh right return so let's add return here. Good. All right, let's see if this works. Quack. Quack. Oh, it doesn't even react to when I click it, I think. Okay, one more thing I wanted to try. Uh, let's see, where was that? That FPS stuff. Because the game has a frame rate of 120, which is way too much, I think. So to reduce performance issues, it might be enough to go to, let's see, Sam Engine. Uh, time. Dude, why are you so slow? <laughs> oh my goodness, you are so slow. I don't, I don't know if I wanted that. Why are you going off screen? Buddy? Oh boy. Did I delete too much? Anyways, uh, to reduce the frame rate issues, here, frame rate, let's change this to maybe 60, maybe 30. And this one we might have to double, I don't know. Uh, we can actually f try to find that out. Let's go to delta time, right click that and analyze and then we can check where is it being read nobody reads it so i guess no nobody really cares about this my duck is outside the screen it's just tapping outside the screen i don't know what's up with the duck S uh, sorry goose i keep saying duck oh boy so i might have screwed up here just S what yes i definitely did so the order was like this right right let me just kill the duck uh, duck escape hello uh oh okay there it is wow look at that it's super slow I, I did something really bad it's actually just slowed down for whatever reason Oh my goodness, what did I do to the goose? Goose, not duck. What is wrong with my head? Anyways, once it's gone, it should be better. Oh, okay, it's gone now. All right, let's hit compile. Let's, did it change the order again? 
Uh, yes. Okay. This is annoying me. Let's try like that. That might work. Okay, let's run the goose. Please don't slow down anymore. We might actually feel good enough about this to speed this up to maybe 280. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh my goodness, it's so slow. All right, so don't do what I did, and it will not. This will not happen to you, hopefully. Jeez. If you have any idea what's going on, it's probably stuck in some, some weird loop. Oof. Well, let's enjoy the duck with faster movement one more time. And uh, the rest, I mean, I'll, I'll leave it to you to figure out how to prevent it from getting that buggy. There. No. I want to see it happen again. There. There. It ha it's just started. Oh boy. Let me know in the comments if you figure out how to prevent it from getting that slow. Until next time, ciao, ciao.